Hi, this is Brian. Welcome back to another Heroic Plus One. As you know, if you've been following along, we launched our book, Arate, Activate Your Heroic Potential, on November 14th, 2023. The weekend before we released the book, we had a little book launch party in Austin and celebrated with a couple hundred heroes. It was awesome. The weekend featured some wisdom from me and some chats with some of my wisest friends, including Mark Devine and Hal Elrod. And just to make sure we all had a good heroic time, we had 3,000 pounds of ice delivered to our hotel and brought up to the rooftop pool deck. 3,000 pounds. So we could all have some fun doing a Wim Hof inspired cold plunge together. Special thanks to my dear friend Jeff Average, who led us in the cold plunge experience. Jeff's a heroic coach and investor who also happens to be a former Navy SEAL who did a fantastic job getting us fired up and freezing. By the way, Jeff is also helping us craft our heroic workshop facilitator training program. If you'd like to become certified in giving heroic workshops, you can learn more in this plus one. We link to it up. Now, as it turns out, the U.S. Men's National Soccer Team, or USMNT, happened to be staying in the same hotel we were in. They were in Austin to play a game the following week, and they were literally right next door. So I texted my friend John Herdman, who won a couple Olympic medals coaching the Canadian Women's National Soccer Team before taking over the Canadian Men's National Team, before taking over the head coaching responsibilities at Toronto FC, where we're in the process of rolling out Heroic, by the way. And I asked John if he knew anyone on the U.S. men's national soccer team. He replied immediately and said that he knew their head coach, Greg Berhalter. Then he text connected us. Now, Greg and I connected immediately and got together the very next day, and we hit it off. He invited me to talk to his team the following night before their big game. Of course, I accepted. It was awesome. The theme of my talk, as you'd expect, I talked about our seven objectives with an emphasis on forging anti-fragile confidence along with heroic strength, not just for two, but for 334,233,854 Americans as those guys go all in seeing if they can win the World Cup on their home turf, our home turf in 2026. Now, Greg told me that his favorite part of my talk was the Josh Waitzkin-inspired idea that we need to make our prior best our new baseline. And that's today's Plus One. Take a moment and think back to a time when you were at your absolute best. What were you doing and what were you not doing? Now, are you currently doing the things you did when you were at your prior best? Or did you let those gains slip? Know this, the best among us never give up those gains. That's what makes them the very best. And that's what we need to do if we're going to activate our heroic potential. So what's one thing you did when you were at your best that you're not currently doing that you know you could be doing that would most positively impact your life if you started doing it again? You got it? Now dominate that. Reinstall that habit. Make your prior best your new baseline starting today.